good evening friends and happy evening to my dear students today i would like to interact with my students after i have read the supreme court judgment my dear young students today supreme court has dismissed the writ petition seeking the intervention of the court for postponement of the je entrance je exams for admission in iits and also neat examination for admission in mbbs that has to be held on 13th september 2020 three bench three member bench of the supreme court has dismissed the writ petition thus paving a way for government of india national testing authority to conduct the joint entrance examination from 1st september onwards for admissions in iits and also a single day examination for admission in mbbs on 13th september so thus it has become certain and so it is very clear that all biology students will have neat examination on 13th september 2020 so my dear students you you will have to write the neat examination on 13th september look at here now how many days are left today is 17th so 13 days are left in august 12 days leave the exam day in the month of september all together you have 25 days every child every student must have a plan what to do how to do during these 25 days in order to get the better rank that will make you to get an admission in mbbs so and uh, so at this juncture i would like to suggest few tips uh, i would like to advise few things to you to write the neat examination uh, very well so the point number 1 my dear students don't lose self confidence don't lose self confidence so you have read each and every topic you have prepared very well and you have written so many grand test so far again you are going to write some more grand test in the days to come so and you you know each and every topic you know each and every subject so definitely you are going to score good good rank then why do you worry so don't lose your self confidence that is the first point every child every student must remember the second one is always think positively yes i know each and everything i prepared very well so definitely i am going to get the good rank so think in a positive way because during these two years you made all your effort to learn each and every sub topics in each topics of each subject then why can't you get a rank definitely you are going to get a rank definitely you are you are going to score maximum marks definitely you are going to write right answers for all questions almost all questions think in such a way at this moment you need positive thinking avoid uh, fear of failure please avoid fear of failure and avoid uh, wavering mind avoid hesitate mood so all will cause you to build up tension in your mind so that, then avoid all those things and have a feeling of success so the point here is avoid doubting mind so because when you when you when you read very well when you know each and every topic why can't you get it definitely you can get it so think in a positive way and very importantly have a plan so yeah, what to do how to do during this 25 days is very very important have a proper plan and execute that plan willingly wholeheartedly 
as a part of that plan you should write each and every grand test that is going to be conducted by your college that is very very important so write as many grand tests as possible don't miss a single grand test write as many grand tests as possible after writing grand test introspect where you are making mistakes where you are you are getting less marks and when and and no analyze by yourself where you have made that mistake is it due to because of uh, uh, not getting the mm, not getting the correct answer by recalling from your brain that is is it because of lack of memory power is it because of lack of understanding the concept is it because of the not able to apply the subject knowledge you have acquired in the classroom in the during the examination think by yourself you are the better judge to know that answer than anybody else after knowing that get it clarified by yourself first if if it is not clarified by yourself after referring books you may ask your colleague then immediately if they are also not able to clarify immediately you call your teacher you send a message to your teacher by whatsapp or call a teacher get it clarified on the same day why because if the same type of questions will be appeared in the final examination you cannot repeat the mistake which you made here if you have clarified the doubt in doing that uh, mis- in doing that uh, problem or in doing in answering that question so my dear young, young students so uh, follow these steps point number 1 have self confidence think positively have a proper plan and execute it in the most disciplined manner with utmost dedication with utmost determination and uh, and take the guidelines from the teachers and uh, write uh, all grand tests that are going to be conducted by the college and don't miss a single grand test after writing grand test analyze by yourself get it clarified your doubts after writing the examination by calling the teacher by sending whatsapp message to the teacher or referring the books if you follow these principles strictly coherently and definitely you are going to get good 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 percentage in neat you are going to get uh, so many mar- so no num- maximum marks in the neat examination and so that you will get a good rank that will that will give you that will get you an admission in mbbs wishing you all success and shubham boyat namaskar